Canada. You giant insignificant country. Can you name 10 Canadian celebrities? You can. Now, can you name 10 Canadian celebrities that actually stayed in Canada? You can't. I mean, Jim Carrey and William Shatner, great guys. They could have stayed. They could have had an entire career here in Canada doing maybe one Canadian tire commercial back in the 90s, but they didn't. They left. Do you know, Canada, that your top 10 companies are four banks, three oil, two gold, and one potash company? But I want to talk to you about the Canadian entertainment industry. Are you laughing? Or are you thinking we've had tons of success in the Canadian entertainment industry? I mean, we had Corner Gas and Little Mosque on the Prairie and Corner Gas. And we have great Canadian sketch comedy, the Royal Canadian Air Force. That ran for about 300 years. And then there was the remake we did of that called This Hour Has 22 Minutes. And we even play the reruns. Because if you didn't find the political commentary of 2007 funny then, you might just now. Take that, Stockwell Day. But as Canadians, we have a lot to be proud of. Like the Canadian company Roots, started by two Americans. And the NHL, whose head office is in New York. And then, of course, there's Mr. Dressup, who is an American. So here's to us, who stay and toil in the banks and oil and gold and potash companies. We may not be celebrities or interesting or remarkable in any way. We're Canadian because we stayed. And we drink coffee and beer. Oh my God, get me out of here.